On Monday, at Los Angeles International Airport, a man was thrown off a United Airlines flight because 30 seconds after, before takeoff, he got up out of his seat to use the restroom, and he locks himself inside a bathroom. Now, they say it's against the law to get up out of your seat during takeoff. I didn't know this. I guess you're not supposed to get up to use the bathroom during takeoff. And then if you get up and you lock yourself in that bathroom, they'll stop the plane because they're afraid. They're not sure. Does the guy have a bomb? I don't know. And this plane was stuck for a couple hours on the tarmac before takeoff. The guy himself should apologize to the passengers just because he got up to use the bathroom. He made them have to wait to take off for their airline flight. Happened. There's this big news story that happened a couple weeks ago. We have this coffee place in town called Badass Coffee. Now it got that name because of a couple hundred years ago, in Hawaii, donkeys were the ones that would transport the coffee. Now, this is a chain of coffee places where they have around 50 of them and 42 in the United States. Well, this location, there's some marketing expert or something that felt there was a lot of negativity towards the name from people in the community and the guy that owned the place I guess was afraid that people wouldn't go to this coffee place because of the name so they changed the name to Royal Aloha Coffee. Now I went to this place once and the coffee was fairly watered down and they were charging three dollars but they were charging so much because it's Kona Coffee from Hawaii. And just the name, Badass Coffee. You're probably thinking it's going to be great coffee. But the name, Royal Aloha Coffee, it sounds generic. And the headquarters for this coffee place is in Salt Lake City, Utah. There's probably a lot of Mormons and people that see the Badass coffee name and you don't want your kids to see it I could understand it but just the name why did they change it to Royal Aloha Coffee I could understand maybe some guy would go into their store and think I ordered a cup of your badass coffee but where's the ass with the coffee and why aren't there any hot chicks in bikinis I demand an answer. It looks like you deceived me. And I would demand you to give me this cup of coffee for free. And if you don't do that, I'll sue you for a billion dollars.